So if you do want to get it tattooed, absolutely do not do it in somebody's garage or apartment. It's very important because you don't know how clean the facility is, you don't know what they're doing, you don't know where the needles come from, you don't know where the inks come from. It's just a bad practice. To be asked to provide proof of age and to fill in a form that the shop is required by the health district to keep on file for two years about the tattoo you got. Charlie Spencer explains that although the health district regulations are strict, they're not a bad thing. Sometimes they're a pain in the ass, but I think for what they do, I mean, they're policing our industry, so it comes across that way. Design. You've looked at the shop for general cleanliness. Now, ask about the artist's qualifications. He or she must have a health card, the business must be licensed, all that stuff. All the needles used must be brand new, in sealed packages, and disposed of appropriately. Any equipment that's not disposable has to be autoclaved or sterilized after each use. Ask about the equipment. The artist shouldn't have anything to hide. 